So as you guys know, I'm rebuilding all of the Sims worlds from scratch using the blowtorch mod and the tool mod. And right now we're in new crest. Okay. If you guys want to see like the other progress of the other worlds, check out my previous videos um, that say realistic world tour, but we're in new crest today. And this is how it is looking so far. Um, I want to show you guys kind of just the progress I've made within the last couple days and guys it looks amazing okay I'm obsessed I am obsessed with having like a school tucked in the middle of a neighborhood I just I don't know I just love it I think it's so cute and you guys know my aesthetic is like suburban Texas Houston style like suburban neighborhood that's like my thing so I'm living for it like it looks amazing and the high school is made by my brother okay check him out on patreon.com slash linked in my description box as usual he made the high school and he's also making another deco high school and he's making two deco middle schools and two deco elementary schools so two of everything so we can have options on schools okay we gotta have the same school in every neighborhood and just stay tuned for that because i'm gonna be showing off the other schools as well but it looks so good it's exactly what i wanted this is exactly like how i pictured my neighborhood to look um and here let's just zoom and i have like some deco sims here you know hanging around lounging around dilly dallying in the neighborhood uh, because deco sims just make like the neighborhood come to life it just makes it look more lively even though at night they do look a little creepy just standing there but just ignore it okay just, just just ignore it um but this is the high school so we have like the parking lot here um the entrance of the school over there just a lot of parking lots um school buses cheerleaders over here practicing we have some kids like sitting over there underneath the tree some kids walking home um i kind of want to create the vibe that like school is out and everybody's kind of like you know doing their little after school thing or like hanging around the school or walking home i kind of wanted to create that vibe instead of like school being in session because i didn't want to have like a whole bunch of cars and like the parking lot and it was just gonna be a mess okay so that's like the vibe that i'm going for with this part of the neighborhood or with this scene or whatever and i did put like trash cans and benches around just like these signs over here that say gun free zone for the school i think i do need to like size some of the things down like just the signs in particular because like compared to like this sim right here this sign is huge um so i am probably gonna like size the uh signs down i get like a little bit messed up when it comes to sizing with like signs and stuff because i'll make them so big and i'm like oh the sims are not that big <laughs> but yeah so that's how that is looking and i'm also going to be like putting homes around ignore these houses over here these homes were already like here um before i started um redoing all the worlds so the houses that are here are not going to be the ones that i keep here they're just kind of like there for right now but i am going to be re rebuilding all of those homes um and i am placing houses over here because like i said i wanted the school to be like nestled in the middle of a neighborhood so i did place some homes over here using tool of course and i also placed this little road here because at first it was just grass over here is grass and like random concrete which you can still see like the random concrete peeking through i was going to cover it with some deco grass but i just don't care enough so here are some of the deco homes and with the houses i decided to put like some realistic doors on them because these are like the ea deco homes and i put like my brother's doors on there just to make them look a little better and I also put like a different garage on there a garage door um just to make the homes look a little bit better i am going to be going through and like adding things to um the houses and like to the backyards like pools and things like more basketball goals things that like your sim can walk over here and do just so like the world can feel more interactive like i'm gonna put some pools in the backyard i don't know if i already said that or not but yeah i'm gonna add some things to the backyard and this is just like most likely the student parking lot over here and the kids can like leave the parking lot and like drive home like i like i said i added these roads in here i'm gonna like finish it's not even close to being done because look at all this space over there but you see how like it's connected to the school like i love the way 
it is coming out. Um, but yeah, I did place all this stuff using the pool mod. I did all this yesterday and I'm like, let me like show them what I've been doing so far. Uh, I'm going to finish the rest today. I'm probably not going to finish it, but I am going to be adding some more stuff today. Um, and place the road down here and just have like a full on neighborhood. I don't know if I'm going to have any like fast food restaurants or place any commercial things here because I want this to just be like a big neighborhood and the school is zoned to um the people that live in this neighborhood obviously but y'all I love the way it looks like just the lighting the homes the trees just everything about it the fence like everything just looks so good it came out exactly how I pictured it you see the basketball goal you see what I had to cover right here by the way like you see this hold on let me like um zoom out a little bit but yeah you see all that i have to cover all of this with the grass um because that is a, a grass rug right there because i can't place like actual terrain off lot unfortunately but um yes yeah, so i'm just placing the roads in the grass over here and i want to like keep doing it and connecting it until we get all the way down there and also all the way over here i'm gonna keep doing that but um yeah, that's pretty much the overview. I just wanted to show you guys like what's going on and keep you updated because y'all love when I show y'all the updates. I'm also going to be doing the same thing to Willow Creek. I showed you guys Willow Creek already, but I'm going to be changing Willow Creek and placing a school there as well. I most likely won't have a school in Delso Valley because Delso Valley is going to be like the commercial area. Y'all seen like all the commercial buildings I had over there. Um, if you didn't go check out that video. Um, it's the one with the thumbnail that has the Walgreens and stuff. But yeah, check that out if you guys want to see how Delso Valley looks. I believe Evergreen Harbor is going to be more of like, maybe like a more urban area. I think I'm going to make that like a more urban area because it just, I don't know. I feel like the homes and just that style of neighborhood kind of fits it. I don't know. I'm still not sure. Um, Not exactly sure what I'm going to do with everything, uh, with all the worlds. I'm kind of just like thinking not thinking but like um doing as i go i guess if that makes sense i don't know but yeah that's pretty much um what the world is looking like like let's zoom in some more like i said the sims look so small but i mean schools are big so but you see how like big that sign is i want to like make that sign a little bit smaller um but yeah like the deco sims are like just talking after school let's go over here where they sitting underneath the tree see what's going on with them they just chit chatting dilly dallying after school and then like the cheerleader i just i'm in awe i love the way it looks love looking at my game um love the deco sims because they just add a whole little like a whole nother level to the game let's go over here with the cheerleaders and i have the school buses there i did size the school buses up just a little bit because i feel like a bus is pretty big um but yeah here are the cheerleaders doing practice i don't have a football field or football stadium or anything because that's typically in the back of the school and you can't see the back of the school so it kind of doesn't matter <laughs> and the school's also just here for decoration like it's not supposed to be an actual school that people are attending like i built a high school for that um i'm not sure what i'm gonna do over here um yeah i'm not sure what i'm gonna do with this area over here because it's kind of like weird i don't know if i'm gonna add some houses over here or just leave it kind of plain i guess i could add like a baseball field or something or yeah like maybe a baseball field but then again i still feel like that would be like in the back of the school so might not do that but i can't wait until the other schools are done like he's making middle schools and elementary schools like i'm so excited i'm gonna just add schools to every neighborhood like i love it this was so fun to do um in my other video well my next video i am gonna like be showing you guys some more easier ways to use tool because there's some ways that i found out and things that i didn't know about which i mean y'all probably know about but i didn't so i'm gonna share it just in case there's other people like me that didn't know about them because it's like it's gonna make using tool way easier um and a lot of people did ask me to 
show them or make a video on how to install the blowtorch mod you just install it like a lighting mod but um i know that the way the files are set up it can be a little confusing especially if you don't like go through and take your time and read it so if you guys are struggling with how to install the blowtorch mod i will make a video and like show you guys it'll probably be in the video that i'll show you guys all the tool stuff because it's kind of quick it doesn't really need its own long video but yeah if you're still struggling with that i will definitely show you um but that's pretty much it i think i kind of covered everything that i wanted to say like this is just supposed to be a quick update video um i am gonna go through and add some more roads and you see this concrete right here like i have to cover all that up um I might put that like time wise in that gas station here though because I feel like there needs to be a place where they can kind of go get something quick to eat like I don't know I feel like it needs to be something like that this is gonna stay the way it is I'm gonna like put more trees and stuff back there but I'm not gonna like try to put any houses or anything back here because this terrain is rocky like it got hills and rocks and stuff it just no I'm just gonna leave that on its own by itself um it would have been nice if i could have added like a little creek or something because i don't think there's any yeah i don't think there's any lakes or creeks around here but that kind of would have been cool but can't place that off lot with tool um yeah this is how the neighborhood looks i am so excited this is so fun to do like also like uh it really beats building like just placing things and like decorating things and making it come to life is way more fun than building sometimes so i am going to be dedicating my time more to this and like less on the building aspect because i don't know it's just more fun and yes the high school is hanging off the back but that's because i mean it's a huge school it's not gonna fit and that also don't matter like it's hanging out in the back but that don't matter y'all like the mall in delta valley is hanging out in the back too but like i said it don't matter <laughs> But um, I'm trying to see if I addressed everything that I wanted to address in the video. Y'all notice how I like hopped right into it in the video too, right? I didn't yap too much in the beginning. I'm trying to like stop yapping so much in the intro and just like hop right into it. So very proud of myself, okay? Giving myself a pat on the back. But yeah, I'm gonna finish working on this today and tomorrow. And I might come back here on Saturday and show you guys my progress. Or we might start placing the um, other school in Willow Creek. And we can probably do that together. I don't know. I'm still trying to decide um, what I'm going to do with that. I don't know if I'm going to jump from here to Willow Creek. I kind of want to finish this though and then go to Willow Creek. Because um, I, I got a lot done over there anyways. But yeah, this is what's going on gotta add some stuff to the backyard and the deco houses that the sims have really aren't that bad to be honest you kind of just gotta dress them up a little bit like they're not that bad like once you dress them up put like some bushes in front of them a door and things it, it looks pretty nice um i'm not gonna show you how it looks at night yet because it's really dark at night i didn't put any street lights or anything there yet which i'm gonna be adding that today so it's pretty dark so i'm not gonna show you guys what it looks like at night but um that's pretty much it for the overview you guys gotta show me how y'all worlds are looking too because a lot of y'all said that y'all using the blowtorch mod and y'all are rebuilding your worlds and you're placing like deco bills around and i want to see how it look so y'all need to let me know tag me on twitter which i'm mostly active on twitter um so kind of just like tag me and show me how the worlds look and we can like kiki and chit chat about it but yeah, that is pretty much um, the gist of this video. Right now, I'm just looking around. Like I could have been in at this video, but I'm like so obsessed that I just keep like panning the camera around and looking around because it just looks so good. Um, but yeah, that's it for me. Like I said, my brother is going to be putting out some more deco schools and just deco buildings in general. Um, so stay tuned for that. And if you want some deco buildings, go ahead and check them out. Go download them. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.